Uh, firstly, I would like to begin on behalf of Sahil and I by thanking the MVPM community, chief guests, jury members, and everyone who has worked so hard to make this program a huge success. It is truly an honor for me to be standing here and receive this award. Now I would like to thank the people around me who have made me who I am today. My parents, my family, my teachers, my professors, my friends. It could not have been possible without them. I just have one last thing to say to all the students here. It was really a pleasure interacting with all of you in the afternoon today. All what I have to say is, if I could do it, so can each one of you. If you continue to believe in yourself and give your 100%. And I'm sure a few years down the line, you would be standing here where I am today. Lastly, many congratulations to all the awardees and thanks once again to the community. Thank you, Madhu, for your inspiring words. Let us all give 100% to all endeavors in our lives. I would now like to call on stage the second pair of awardees Nina Gilida and Yash Heda. As Nina is in Taiwan, I request her parents to come up on her behalf. Yash, can we please have you here on stage? Our next caller, Nina Gilda, is from Satara, Maharashtra. She has completed her PhD in microelectronics from the prestigious IIT Bombay. She works with the world's leading semiconductor company, the largest assembler of mobile phone processors for Apple iPhones. With her never-ending passion for knowledge, she is now pursuing her postdoctoral fellowship at Northwestern University, USA. She was awarded with CSIR travel grant and is a recipient of the coveted Gandhian Youth Award for Innovation in Technology and has presented several research papers globally. She also has three patents to her credit. Her list of achievements also includes CII's 3M Innovation Award. Nina has been titled as Young Scientist of India by the Outlook India magazine. Her research work was showcased on ET Now. Success mantra of our astute and brilliant scholar is take risks and conquer your fears. She wants to help the world by creating sustainable smart solutions touching common man's life. We wish all her dreams get fulfilled. Our second promising scholar, Yash Heda, from Amravati is a chartered accountant and a company secretary. He is currently working with Deloitte while he's also pursuing CFA. He was one of the top three in CAIPCC and secured an All India Ranking 22 in CA Final. Not only this, he is also amongst the first 10 rank holders in CS Final. Yash represented India in National Convention ICA at Sri Lanka. Our young scholar is also a Sultan Chand silver medalist. His success mantra is, just believe everything is possible. We wish you all the very best for your future. May I request the sponsor of the second pair of awards, Sri Ramesh Shri Kasat, to come up on the stage. I also request Sri Nilesh Shri Laddad, member of the MVPM's Maheshwari Scholar Committee, to accompany our sponsor. Sri Ramesh Shri and Shri Kanji Kasat are the torch bearers of the renowned Shiv Naran Ramnaji Kasat family of Pune. They excel in multi-diversified industries, ranging from the extensive packaging business in Dubai to textiles, pharmacy, and financial sectors. I request Sri Lakhani Ji to felicitate our noble donor.
May I request Sri Lakhani ji to present the awards. First, to promising scholar Yash Heda. Now, to scholar Nina Gilda, I request her father, Dr. Avinash Gilda, to connect the award on her behalf. If your actions inspire others to dream more, learn more, do more, and become more, you are a leader. Our next set of awardees are a true embodiment of this saying. I would like to call the third pair of scholars, Darshit Jaju and Priyanka Loya, to come on the stage. Hails from Maligaon Nasik, Maharashtra. He is an alumnus from India's best business school, IIM Ahmedabad. He is working as a leadership associate at Hindalco Industries. This brilliant scholar has pursued his B.Tech in civil engineering from the renowned IIT Roorkee. His article, What Will It Take to Reach Double Digit Growth? has received appreciation from the World Bank's global contribution. He has also played an important role in the design and planning of 8,300 toilets for over 4 lakh children, a CSR initiative by Power Group Corporation of India. He is the recipient of gold medal in design innovation by the Indian Ministry of Steel. Darshit was the youngest member of Indian Commerce Ministry's Green Building Program. His success mantra is, Perseverance is the secret ingredient of success. In times to come, he wants to pursue PhD and wishes to be a corporate leader in building a sustainable future. We wish you grand success in all your endeavors. Our next promising scholar, Priyanka Loya, hails from Jodhpur. She has obtained three top professional qualifications at a young age of 21. She is working as associate manager at Hero Motor Corp and is also pursuing CFA. Her educational pursuits have always been extraordinary. She has consistently topped the All India Charts with All India Rank 8 in CMA, All India Rank 36 in CA, and All India Rank 17 in CS Intermediate. She has received the Pramila Jaising Gold Medal and has also been awarded with the prestigious MHRD and N Sarkar Scholarships. At a very young age, she has even co-authored the book Mathematics genius. Our scholar not only believes in working hard, but also working smart. Wishing Priyanka the very best in life. May I request the sponsor of the second pair of awards, uh, Sri Kailashri Biyani, to come up on the stage. I request Sri Amitji Rathi. Member of the MVPM's Maheshwari Scholar Committee to accompany our sponsor. Sri Kailashri Biyani from Mumbai is a financial wizard and is on the board of many reputed finance companies. He has more than 20 years of experience in marketing, sales and relationship management in various fields like FMCG, electricals and electronics, life insurance and more. 
He is one of the top share brokers and also an advisor to many high net worth individuals and corporates for their financial strategies. Apart from all this, he is religiously involved in many philanthropic activities in the field of education and health. May I request Dr. Malpani ji to felicitate uh, our sponsor, uh, Sri Ramesh Kasat is here on his behalf. May I request Dr. Malpani ji to present the awards. First, to promising scholar Priyanka Loya. And now to our scholar, Darshit Jaju. Thank you, sir. I request Darshit to share his views with all of us. Thank you so much. Uh, it's a great honor to be, uh, you know, one of the awardees here and uh, uh, receiving such a uh, such a wide recognition. Uh, thank you so much, MVP. Uh, I would I would uh, like to extend my thanks to my parents who have always been an inspiration to me. Uh, my mother has always transcended uh, the constraints of age. She did her MBA at the age of 48. And, uh, and she is learning violin now. So, uh, I mean, she has always been an inspiration to me to learn more and more. Uh, this is just a beginning, I should say. Uh, this award is not just a recognition, I take it as a responsibility to uh, take this uh, good work forward. Because uh, a, lot has, a lot has to be done. And uh, I hope that I will make all of you, the Samaj and India proud once again in the future. Thank you so much. Thank you, Darshan, for enlightening us with your thoughts. I think we can rightly say, behind every successful scholar is a superb mother. I now invite our next pair of scholars, Archie Cabra and Jharna Maheshwari to come up. This is a very special pair as both the awardees are females and it is our honour to present the very special Jharna Maheshwari who stands against all odds and goes on to reach the pinnacle of academic glory. As rightly said by Helen Keller, the best and most beautiful things in the world cannot be seen or even touched. They must be felt with the heart. Apni isi kabiliyat se Jharna ne wo sapne dekhe jo hum apni khuli aankhon se bhi na dekh paaye aur unhe badi hi kamyabi se sach kar dikhaya aspired colleges of India, IIT Bombay. She is an associate consultant at McKinsey & Company, a leading international consulting firm. 
Archie completed her B.Tech and M.Tech in Metallurgy and Material Sciences from IIT Bombay. Her research paper on small and medium enterprises were applauded at the IIM Ahmedabad. With her strength and vigor, she swam non-stop for 12 long hours, traveling 18 kilometers and was awarded the role of honor. She has won silver medal in 36 state-level aquatic championships. She stood third in the International Mathematics Olympiad. She received the esteemed Above and Beyond Award by General Electric. Her mantra for success is, success always goes to the person who thinks he can. She envisages to work for the FMCG industry and innovate customer-centric solutions. We wish you all the very best. Our next promising scholar, Dr. Jharna Maheshwari from Palampur, is truly an inspiration, probably the first among equals. She has pursued her doctorate in English literature on the topic study of 19th century Gujarati models and is an assistant professor at the Central University of Gujarat. Before her doctorate, she also pursued masters in philosophy and has received gold medals in MA as well as BA. Hard things are put in our way not to stop us, but to call out our courage and strength. Jarna is an epitome of such immense strength. She has received various meritorious scholarships for her outstanding achievements like Marga Schultz Merit Scholarship from the All India Council of Blind and KV Memorial Award for Visually Impaired. She is a living example of a success mantra, impossible is nothing. Jana, we wish you a glorious future ahead. I would request Sri Mukund Das Ji Purushottam Ji Lohia, who is the magnanimous donor of this set of awards to kindly come up on the stage May I also request Sri Ashish Jirati, member of the MVPM's Maheshwari Scholar Committee, to accompany our sponsor. Sri Loyaji is the proprietor of one of the oldest reputed firms of Pune, with its wings spread out in the financial and infrastructural sectors. His philanthropic trust, Sri Lohia Pratishthan, has been serving multiple social causes for several decades. May I request Dr. Anirudji Malpani to felicitate our sponsor. I now request Dr. Malpani ji to present the awards. First, to our promising scholar Jharna Maheshwari. Congratulations, Jaina. Cabra. Thank you, sirs. Thank you, ma'am. I now request Jharna to speak a few words for us. I'm sure all of us here are waiting to hear her thoughts and her pearls of wisdom. Uh, my earnest thanks to MVPM
for this great recognition and honor. Uh, I dedicate this award to my parents, my siblings, my friends, and my entire extended Mayeshwari family who provided me with the platform to explore my potential and unleash it. Uh, as I have been pursuing my research in the area of humanities, and I often confront the question, what kind of research you do in the area of humanities? Shakespeare ko padke, Shakespeare ke story mein se kya research hota hai? You don't go to you don't go to laboratories. I will say we don't go to the laboratories, but society itself is a huge laboratory for us. And <laughs> and humanities make us human. We learn how to become human. We learn how to teach someone how to become human. Uh, be, be, being human, that means we learn how to diagnose the social problems. Once we diagnose those problems, we work towards creating an inclusive society and we work for achieving a high goal of uh, peace and harmony. Thanks a lot. Thank you everyone for such a great honor. Thank you so much, Vaina. May this peace and harmony always remain and enhance. Archie, now your turn to enlighten us with your words. Thank you so much. I would like to extend my deep gratitude to the entire MVPM committee, the jury, the board members, and a, a, a heartfelt thanks to the chief guests and the guest of honor who could like take time out for us and this event. And uh, the entire student community for putting up a set as grand as the Filmfare Awards. I'm feeling no less than a celebrity at this moment. Thank you so much. So, in my college, we have Swimathon, which is uh, a swimming marathon, one of its own kind, where you swim for 12 hours straight. I was able to finish it thrice in the five years of my college, uh, college period. So, I find Swimathon to be very synonymous to life. So, the first six hours are, really, you know, enthusiastic. You feel very...